Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Lucette and today we're going to be talking about some Revolve clothing. I probably heard of Revolve from Instagram from all these beauty and fashion influencers and I was really curious about this brand, like what they offer. So Revolve hosts a lot of brands from all over the world and all of these brands, their clothing and their, fa their collections are on the website of Revolve. And today I got a few items to show you. Hopefully it's a good one. So for today, I'm wearing my Louis Vuitton Star Blossom pendant, which I mentioned and also revealed. I did a little video of it in my last video. So if you're interested in that video, please follow this link and watch it. Okay, on the first item, we have a real dress in hyper mint. When I first saw this picture online, it looked so beautiful. And I really loved the color because I thought it was like a more of a pastel green but instead it's a little bit on the neon side I'm not really a big fan of neon so i'm not too sure about the color and i thought it would be a better material because it was a little bit pricey for this small piece of clothing it's supposed to be asymmetrical on the bottom and on one side it's too short on me so if i just if there's a little wind it's like everyone will see everything <laughs> but i don't mind it that much i will just probably wear a short on the bottom this is what it looks like and the materials i think it's polyester it's a hundred percent polyester um i would rate this probably a six out of ten Although I do like the style of this, I'm not too keen on the color because it's a little bit different than what I saw on the website. And also the length of this is not that comfortable for me. Okay, so the next item is actually a black dress. Um, I actually love this dress but I haven't worn it out yet. If I wear it with a corset or something, it would look way better, but unfortunately due to this pandemic, I gained weight and my stomach is a little bit chubby, but it's fine. And overall, I do love a black dress, so I would give this one a 7 out of 10. I would deduct a few points because it's not what I expected from the quality or you know the material of this for and for the price of this it's <laughs> it's a bit pricey it's like $215 for the next item I was actually super excited to receive this one when I saw it on the model and on the website it looks so beautiful but it is not what I expected it's totally different from what I expected um, on the model, it looked like so fresh and so young and so beautiful, but on me, it looks like a grandma print. So, you know, these type of prints, I would see this probably on like curtains or just not, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to like this one. And even on the breast area, since I'm a little bit of lacking, short under it that is pretty comfortable the material itself is like quite nice compared to the first one and this is 100% real so this is what it looks like and with it I will probably have to tie this twice because 
Okay, so for the next item on the list is a white romper. Um, it's the Battles romper in seagull color from YFB clothing. And the original price is $158, but I paid $102 for it. It's also in a size medium, and I don't like it at all. The, the top part is big, and the bottom is too small. My thighs won't even fit, and you can literally see everything. So it's not the piece for me. I actually washed it once and it's all wrinkly but I still haven't worn it out because I don't think I will wear it out because the bottom half is too small on me it's not comfortable I would rate this a 3 out of 10 honestly and that's because of the material it's a little bit comfortable but that's it the style itself it doesn't really look good on me like and it was, it was such a struggle to put this on and even when I take it off, it's not stretchy at all so I have to remove a limb or something to just get this romper off of me On the next item is actually a white short On the website, it looks so beautiful and so chic on the model but on me, I'm not even going to try because it doesn't really fit me so when I try to put it on, it won't even get past my thighs it's that small even though I got a medium and I should have gotten a large but even with a large I think I was struggling too and especially with the material too it's kind of see-through so you can so you will probably have to wear a thong or like a really nude color underwear to actually be able to pull this off because from what I see on the website it looks like a thick material but it's not so I would probably give this a 2 two out of 10 Yeah Okay, on the next item on my list is this white dress be So there's only um, So little few options that I can choose from from the sizes It's either small medium or medium large So I got the medium large But turns out it's too large on me I, I, like, I really like the style, it's like so casual and you can wear it to the beach or just have a really nice dinner out But it's a little bit too large on me Even though I like it, but If the size was a little bit smaller, then I would absolutely give it a 10 out of 10 But I gave it a 8 out of 10 And this color is in the cream color, it's also from L space or Las Paz is a Barcelona dress in cream. Um, the material itself is super comfortable, and I think it's like a percentage of cotton and another percentage of something else. I'm not sure. Well, I can't really find the material what it's made of, but I will link it down below to the description box if you're interested on in seeing what it's made of. And also, if you're also interested in the other pieces, then I will link, I will try and find all the links and list it down below for you guys. I actually also got sandals. It's the Jama sandal in cream, and it's from Tiki's. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right, and it's $50. Um, I was going to pair this sandal with a white dress, but this sandal is a little bit too narrow on me Even though I got it on my size, the sizing is perfect, but it's not really made for wide feet Because the strap itself, it doesn't stretch and it hurts when you slide your feet in it, so it doesn't fit me at all But I will try to stretch it out still because I I, I do like it, but it's just the sizing, sizing itself is not for me. For the next item on my list are these dresses that I got a while back, but I still haven't worn them. And I will show you why. Okay, on the first... Wait, it's not the first. Okay, on the next item on my list is the Clinton Midi dress in Scarlet Red. Um, I got it in a size medium, but I did not take into account that I actually gained weight so it didn't fit me so when I tried to zip this up it didn't go all the way up and 
I actually quite like this dress if only it's a size bigger when I ordered like this dress um, it's comfortable and but it, the, the only thing is it doesn't fit me because I didn't order a size large for me but I ordered a medium instead and I should have ordered large so that was my mistake it would have been so cute if it did fit me okay so another dress and this order that doesn't fit me is from the Majorelle Nolita mini dress in red and it's, a, it's, it's and it's also the size medium so I absolutely do not like this dress because um, I look like the emoji, the dancing emoji and also it doesn't zip all the way up on the bottom half there's like the lines and the frills and that area is so tight, it's not elastic, it's really tight so I can't really move around or sit around. I can, yeah, I can basically do nothing in this dress. It's only for show in my closet, to be honest. Okay, for the next item on the list is a white dress. It's the Bruna dress in ivory from Parker. And it's in a size medium, and this one did fit me. I actually wore this on Valentine's Day. I will show a picture here. And I love it. It's, it's like quite feminine and girly so I have nothing to complain about this dress besides that it's not that um, comfortable to move around just a little bit like uh, I think it's a little bit tight here so it's not elastic I don't know why they keep doing that why don't they just put something more elastic -y? <laughs> but besides that I like it Okay, so for the next item and also the last item on my list is a green dress. It's the Kaylin off-shoulder dress in emerald and it's from Super Down. I got this in a size large but even in large it didn't fit me. I actually love this piece, it looks great but unfortunately I couldn't zip it out by myself because when I tried to move a little bit further to the back in this area, like these off the shoulder things will get in my way so I, I can't actually zip it up by myself so I, so I would have to ask someone to help me with this dress but overall I really like this dress it's like super cute for a girls night out or like clubbing if you do like to go clubbing um, I like it but okay maybe on the breast area it's a little bit risky because uh, the cup itself is small so so besides the cup and also this thing getting in your way of actually zipping it up I would say this is a pretty cute dress I would give this a 7 out of 10 Alright guys, that's it for today's video and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys next week Bye! Always in the slow mode.